just pick a unit early, give it a croissant, and then get HP scaling later. Okay, you don't have faint abilities. That's okay. We'll just take an iguana. How about a, a milky piece? Chicken is a mistake. I agree, chicken is a mistake. You typed it wrong. You type M-U-S-T-T-A-K-E for some reason. Which I, I can't imagine why. But I, I agree with you wholeheartedly. I think it's a big mistake. Love that. Okay. So, I think if we could get our beaver a croissant, that would be fantastic. Maybe, it, it, like, HP scaling is the, is the meat and or potatoes of this one. I could live with that. Once you get the mental model, everything else falls into place. Hey, five gifted subs. Thanks for the five gifted subs. Thank you. Much appreciated. Roll me. Croissant is a tier two. Great intel. I don't really like a level two seahorse. I think you're doing well as is. You take a croissant. For now, why don't we take a B just to create favorable trades? And sure, I'd love to I'd love to get both of these. Parrot behind white tiger. Okay, I'll work on that in, in 25 minutes from now. I lived. If you don't get dog, just stay alive until vulture fly white tiger. I can do I can keep that in my head. Vulture fly white tiger. Vulture fly white tiger. Honestly. For my unique skill set, I actually think the Okapi is kind of sick, especially on a on a currently flawless run. Don't, 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 don't. You you shuffle me, I would gladly shuffle you. Vest zebra. Okay. You're gone. You're here. Roll. Don't respect any of it. Roll. I respect none of it. Roll. There's a beaver there. Honestly, I don't respect it. It's beautiful. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. I love it. I, I've, I've never loved anything as much as this. As much as this. The Okapi Death Spiral. Are you crazy? Because what we do is we just pivot to uh, Vulture, Tiger, Fly as soon as it we... The Okapi is just to keep us in the damn game. Then we get to launch our, uh, our master plan on round 17, the way God intended. Honestly, the Iguana's got to go. You had your chance. Then roll me. Next round. Next round. I don't mind, honestly. I mean, it, it's the weekly that's turning me into this kind of scumbag. My squad? Wait a minute, I'm completely fine. Never mind. I'm completely fine. Never. Okay, good. Smart team, smart team. N unnecessary. Go ahead. I wouldn't mind a little, like a lollipop. Sans lollipop. We roll. It's that simple. Two beavers. Holy kid. No, no, we definitely need a turtle first. Fox is Pog? Used to be. Used to be. Then it, beta it became too good. They forced it to change. And honestly, that's just sad. I don't think a fox should ever have to change for anybody.
Level three beaver. Next time. <laughs> Next time. <laughs> lollipop? 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 No lollipop, huh? I think we want like... Like this. <laughs> oh, man. No, the orangutan! <laughs> The exact thing I was asking for! Oh no, my team? My psycho order? Holy cow, we still drew. Okay. Level me? This is exactly what was requested of us. Sell the Okapi, because it, it, it will combine these, we'll figure out something to do with these. You're just not along for this world. By the fly. Bzz, by the way, a little bzz. You only summon three? Whatever, we could put you here and then get you a little buffer. I don't mind that. You still get three triggers probably. How about an orangutan? Maybe? Maybe there's something here. How about freezing a scorpion just to think about it in the future? How many? We're at five. This is my most successful run. Five wins. I lived. Still lived. Still alive. Still crazy after all these years. Didn't quite finish the job. My God. Okay, there's six. I think we're done with you. Why don't you come out? You're gonna buff this hatching chick, which I don't want. But I also don't really want you to buff the turtle, which is guaranteed to happen right now. I guess you'd just be happy that there's like a buff happening at all. Sell the hatching chick by a vulture. Now the vulture's being buffed. The only thing is you needed to not get sniped. That's not an easy thing to, to manifest. But hey, it'll have enough HP to survive a snipe eventually if, if we're able to draw enough, I suppose. What a shot. What a shot. More, keep him coming. Whoa! Please. I need more. There's a lot going on here, man. We. Oh, oh, oh. Yes! <laughs> That's a draw. We take those. Okay. Um, I think at this point we do have to say, I mean, the turtle can go first. I also think that the beaver can go. We just need as many spawns as possible. Probably start... Keep the beaver? I don't, I don't know if you... I guess it's. it does have good enough stats. You can go, though. I would love to just lollipop you. I'm content with this. For now, I would like you to survive one snipe. That's a strong unit. I'm a little scared by that. That's a very strong unit. Come on, let's, let's get some shots in here. You've summoned a rat. Do I like a rat? I would say I don't dislike a rat. More damage, please. More damage. More... Dude, we were actually really close. We were one hit away from a draw against a team that was very strong. I feel okay about that. Yes? Level two fly. Let's give it a shot. What it, dude? Look at two can play this game. 
Okay, so you shot me. That don't impress me much. The more of me that you kill, the more of me, the more of you that's dead. You ever think about that? Listen, you piece of crap. Son of a bitch. <laughs> okay. Six wins. But I felt like that time we actually were starting to do a little bit better. I felt like I had a, I had a, a line that I could follow the whole time. I'll take two ants. Early on, that's fine. I'll take three ants. Let me be a cartoony shirt. <clears throat> Love it. Love it. Look at that. Yeah, no, I, I agree. It kind of seems like the, the best play... I mean, this is self-evident, I suppose. The best play is to, like, live as long as possible until the Tier 6s show up. Um, and then completely rework your run as necessary to fit into one... I mean, this is just based on one round. But to fit into, like, one archetype... Hold on, I gotta take this. One second. All right, I'm back. They, they moved up my appointment with the internal medicine specialist. Let's go. Step seven of 35,000 to getting a diagnosis. Okay. Level me. I feel like the turtle's been hard to, it's been hard to understand. Why don't you give me one of these? Why don't you give me one of these? I still love to take it. Maybe that's my problem. I still love a pug as well. I don't know. Maybe there's something wrong with me, but I still love a pug. A croissant. You got to buy a croissant. Last step is a colonoscopy. I literally don't care. I would honestly like pull down my pants for that shit in two seconds if they would actually do it. Instead, we got to go through, uh, jump through a thousand hoops, even though I don't even go to the doctor like once every five years to figure out if I've got like Munchausen syndrome or something. She drives me crazy. <laughs> okay. Croissant on the beaver. And that's our unit that's going to stick around. Not going to do it. Not going to do it. These units are ass and I can live with that. Just give me a turtle that trades. A turtle that trades. Maybe oh, it's okay. The rest of their squad is not that good. Easy money. Okay, the iguana doesn't do anything for us. Get buffed. Don't need a lollipop just yet. Not interested. Four wins in five rounds. This is surprising to me. You know what? Who cares? Maybe levels matter. Maybe this is the rare pack where a level makes a big difference. Okay, maybe, maybe.
in these situations, you might have to consider a carrot. It's a tier 6 food. I don't know if this has been made clear yet. Maybe it's a tier 5, but it's not available yet, either way. I still don't want the lollipop. We can, we can go a little further. Not interested? You know what? If the ant's sticking around for a bit, I'm interested. Let's get an ant that trades. How dare you? Honest, that's such a cheeky lynx. I'm a little offended, but, but also very impressed. Okay, you're gone. You're in. More snails? You know what? I, I gotta learn my lesson. Can me. We can for the future. Sell me. Buy me. I would love to have a permanent 2-2 buff. I would, I would love to have permanent 2-2 buffs incoming. Maybe, maybe we'll can before we buy you next time. Maybe this is a, maybe this is a can week. Everyone's saying chicken. So, of course, we should just buy can, which is a superior chicken. It makes perfect sense. Dude, it's too easy. Can me. Level me. Buff the beaver permanently. You could run a lionfish if you have to. I'm not, I'm not taking a dog round eight. I'm just not that kind of guy. He don't got the damn dog in him. Nineteen seventeen Okapi. I'm scared. I'm not scared. We draw. We have to make an important decision. I think we would like a level 3 hatching chick, honestly. The eel is also tempting. It's tough. Why? Well, I want the level 3 hatching chick. Because... Okay, we're going insane here. I want the level 3 hatching chick because... There's no chocolate in the pack. So I feel like having some chocolate in the form of a level 3 hatching chick would be very helpful for me. We don't need to level you up. You're doing great as is. Okay, then next time, maybe we put a lollipop on this beaver. I'm not totally sure. I'm not totally sold on it yet, but I'm feeling okay about it. Okay, after all these question marks, it was like the easiest win in my life. As usual, the masses don't know what they're talking about. Take one of those. We'll take one of these. Roll me. Definitely, I'll take one of these still. You act like that means you were right? You bet on 10 wins, my brother in Christ. You're in bed with the damn enemy right now. Okay, we are going to lose this one. You act like that means you're right. Sure. It's a tough one. Mushroom ant? It's so mid. It's actually so mid. But, tiger, vulture, mushroom ant. Then you got me thinking. You got me thinking that maybe, but how are we going to fit this on the damn team? You're going to have to sell your orangutan. And I'm okay with that. Okay, okay, let's give it a try. We really need this level two eel, man. I'm telling you, it changes everything. 
please. Just a little more. Just a, just a little more. Oh my god, we're gonna do it. Okay, let's go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And I'm like, and I'm like, oh, for now, forget the fly for now. I get, like, don't get me wrong. I think it's it's possibly the right play. But we 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 invested all this in a level three hatching chick. I want to see where it can go. Okay. I want to see if it's got the capability. I already know I'm going up against a Discord uh, moderator, and that's okay. I'm willing to accept that. I mean, that was a, a dog chicken team. Beautiful shot, okay? Now you can... Well, I don't know. I'd still like to give you the buff, but we got we to gotta figure out how we're going to do it, okay? Go for it. Take take a random taco. See if I care. You already have a level 3 tiger? Or a level 3 vulture? You know what? When you put it that way, I suppose that's damn true. <laughs> I wasn't really thinking my way through that one. I do feel like I'm... Anybody else feel like I'm kind of getting screwed on my uh, vulture luck? Maybe not. Alright, I'll take my 8 wins either way. Okay, eight wins. We're improving a little bit. How do you feel about fighting games? I don't know, man. I'm 33 damn years old. I got a kid. Watch The Bear. You've been here for five hours asking me if I've seen that HBO show The Bear, man. I don't know. I don't even know what the hell it's about. You work on the bear? Are you part of the street team? I like the viral marketing astroturf squad for the damn bear. Let me get here. Here it comes in chat. It's pretty good. Yeah, I bet it is. It wouldn't surprise me. It's from HBO, right? Like most of the stuff they make seems seems pretty good. Watch it now and tell me your opinion. I don't know if I've made my... That's a great name. If I've made my case um, solidly enough about my current physical health. <laughs> I'm really trying to impress it upon people so that their expectations are set for when I have to cancel some streams to see a doctor again. <laughs> people just tell me it sounds like a lot of belly aching and I'm like, that's why I'm in the emergency room, doctor. Okay, this team scares me. If you have to, you have to. You know what? Give it a try. Is he scrometing? I did. I almost succumbed to social media and quote tweeted that... Um, that UK journalist who said that there's a a new medical phenomenon on the rise called scrometing is after uh, months of heavy cannabis use you scream and vomit uncontrollably at the same time and that like honestly that nobody's calling it scrometing like that's just a ridiculous statement but then I looked well I scrolled deeper into like the tweets or whatever people were like you know she's obviously like lying and making this up but there actually is something called like you know cannabinoid hyperemesis syndrome or something like that where it's very, extremely rare but some people who are heavy cannabis users just like uncontrollably vomit for weeks at a time and the only only thing you can do is uh is cease use of the of the product in question i didn't know i didn't know that that was a thing but my friend literally has that right now. It's wild. How's he been enjoying the scrometing discourse on... on well, maybe he's not on Twitter because he's throwing up so much. I got a similar thing, but the vomiting was pretty chill. 
Well, you know, um, like that's that's good. I guess I could try this. I'm not necessarily sold on it. Now nah, she's joining in on Twitter on the meme. Okay, well, that's good. I think. That's an incredible team. You got me. I gotta be honest with the believers. I don't think this squad is going anywhere. <laughs> I, think we're, I think we have no future already. Um, I don't know who's... Maybe you can inherit the croissant and then I could lollipop you a little earlier than usual. It's okay. It's okay. It's just a little airborne. Holy cow, we're gonna win this one. Hey, I just watched Koyanis Katsi. Any hot takes? Yeah, I've never... I don't think I've ever seen all of Koyanis Katsi. I hear it's beautiful, though, this time of year. Okay, about one of those. You know what? I, I don't mind it. We sort of have to do this. We have to pivot to this early hippo. I think we have to do this immediately. And if we've got to get rid of our um, our iguana, then we got to get rid of our iguana. That's fine. This could go off. That's all. Honestly, honestly, I'm not even upset. That's fine. Honestly, that's fine. Now you need to get as buff as possible. Forget the dog. It's a lazy man's play. You know what? You're going to call me crazy. This buffs our hippo. I think you can hold your own for now. I would really you rather had something else, but for now, just enjoy your stats. This team is like perfectly engineered to upset me. <laughs> yep, here it comes. Here comes the upsetting. Sell me. Can me. Buff me. Let me get the level two dragonfly. That's all I ask. Can't really run a lynx here, man. Well, like, I'm trying to think if I sold my cricket and then put a lynx at the front, I could, but then I got a hippo in position four, which seems pretty not good. <laughs> I'll go a step further, seems pretty absolutely horrible. Okay, level two hippo coming is kind of sick. Let's talk about that then. Please, just let me go sicko mode. Hippo, right? Like, it, everybody else gets to run 17 runs that go hippo mode, sicko mode. I'm not going to can yet. We need to see what the level grants us. I still want the XP. I wouldn't sweat the XP. I think we got one more round of this. And seeing if it works. Like, you don't really need to give the experience anymore. Could talk about putting the kickstarted kangaroo. Oh, and the hippo's level two is not even getting the buff anymore. That's true. It's very true. Whatever. I don't even care that you killed those guys. It's not relevant to me. It's not relevant to my worldview. That's more. Re That's relevant to my worldview. Okay. Can me? Your ass is gone. Your ass has arrived. Level two kangaroo. Pug's getting a lot of buffs. I'm not necessarily thrilled about that, but it is what it is. You know what? When in doubt, can for the endless pivot. Oh, 
Level 3 turtle. I'm upset. I'm upset by this level 3 turtle. On the other hand, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. We draw. <laughs> Just give me another dragonfly. It's driving me crazy. If I could just get one more dragonfly, dude. I, I believe we're gonna get it here. Okay, sure, whatever. Unfathomable. Honestly? Don't desync air me. I desync air you. It's driving me crazy. It's driving me crazy. What the hell's going on? I don't even understand what's happening here. Hold on, it's the greatest thing that's ever happened to me. The whole squad's popping off. I do think a gorilla could kind of pop. Like this? And give me the dragonfly. <laughs> Please? You know what, brother? Go ahead. Give me a dragonfly, man! Hold on, we're already- we, we came pre-coconutted? Badger, what the hell? We win these? We still win these. Okay, somehow. It's very simple. I'm just gonna need a quick little dragonfly to really tie this run together. Okay. Such a melancholy team. Perfect for right after a breakup so long, my love. Um, I have it on, on good authority that many people are saying this. I'm sorry, you can't do it. Oh my god, you can draw? Holy cow. Okay, you at this point, I gotta acknowledge, you're literally generating a 1-1 buff. So like, no, you're generating two 1-1 buffs. I might rather just bring a reindeer in here. It gets it gets built-in melon armor at the very least. I don't think it's worth a lot, but I think it's worth more than a than a two-two buff. There's my dragonfly. After, after everything that we went through, there's my dragonfly. It was it was always only three rolls away. I mean, this doesn't seem amazing, but it doesn't seem that bad. My god, we did it? Okay. Man giving up mining.jpg. So true. Hey, look, there's another one. Should take some support. One attack. I'm not that interested. This, I'm mighty interested. You maybe, I'm starting to think maybe you should be up here. I don't know really what the reindeer's job is, but. Pug gorilla? I don't know, man. I feel like pug kangaroo is getting the job done. I don't know if it's going to work this time. We got a, this is a pretty strong team. They got a big orca. But so what? Big orca. Like, who cares? Wait a minute. They don't have a vulture, though. This doesn't seem that bad. Okay. Okay, we drew. Scary, but we made it. Take another one. Ice cream. <laughs> Gorilla? Okay. So many dragonflies. This shit will make you throw up, dude. It's just like, it, now that we got rid of the dragonfly, we would have had a level three dragonflies by, uh, dragonfly by now. Don't snipe my kangaroo and, and tell me it's raining. Highly unfortunate. Okay, this team just destroyed us. That one was not even close. 
we're all in. All in. You know what? You had your chance. 9-5 Scorpion. I'm trying. You got a level 3 Hippo. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. What? It's the strongest team I've ever seen? Okay. Dude, dude. 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 We're getting so close. Okay, there's eight. Eight wins. We're so close. The green pepper difference makes me sick. Okay, I'll bet on anything but a horse. No mods, though. That's nice. No mods. How about um, a flabbergasted personality? When are we getting back to PG-13 rated content? Um, this is a false dilemma. I don't know who sold you that lie. Oh, casino. Yeah, we'll open up the casino immediately. Thank you. That is something I can do for you. I don't want an ant. You know what? I could take a koala just for a second. Just, just to see how it feels. What the hell? My god, we won. Koala has no synergies this week. It has a yak still. And with such limited scaling, I actually feel like a yak kind of makes a lot of sense. We just got to figure out how to keep his HP high enough. Um, you know what? For now, I think you let the chinchilla go off. Why not? Honestly. I've been watching Game of Thrones for the first time. What the hell happened to that show? It's um, it's a it's a tale as old as time. Start a seven series or eight series run of a television series. Um, pray that the author who writes the source material writes one novel before um, you actually reach the end. Oh, don't worry, that's 2017 us's problem. Like everything will be okay. And then he became the slowest author of all time, and uh, and everything just fell apart. You noob. So true. We, we, we croissant. It's that simple. We croissant and we lollipop. And then she let me lick the wrapper. I just don't see a world in which tamarind makes sense. Like how, you know what? Sure, let's buy it. I really don't see like we need to buy you either, except that it's just a, it's a one, one buff, I guess. Okay, actually you being gone in favor of you coming out here actually matters a lot. No, if I was George R. R. Martin, I would definitely never finish the books. I feel like you, um, you can't win by, by finishing the books. Oh no, I forgot the rest of my squad is pure detritus. We don't need it. You take this, we'll sell into something later. How about another koala? That would really hit the spot. You know what? If koalas are sticking around, how about you take a croissant? This might be an illogical extension of where this should go, but we're certainly gaining some stats over time. I don't think I would ever... I mean, what do, what do you get by finishing the, the books? I mean, I guess you get some money. But like on a on a more broad like you know uh, oh we're toasted here holy cow on a more broad like legacy sense like I mean I think the the only way to go is like down right now right give me one of these one of these people would complain less 
In some ways, George R. R. Martin and I work in the same industry, and I would say that definitely the more you do, the more people complain. It's only as you approach... Like, when I'm working really hard, people will complain to me constantly. I did, like, almost no work this weekend as I tried to recuperate a little bit. You know what the big controversy was on my subreddit? Somebody called ContraPoints a bad YouTuber. First off, imagine it being like a Sunday on a long weekend, and that's how you choose to spend your time to begin with, is getting involved with this argument. But, uh... <laughs> Hold on, let me think here. I don't think... I think I have to scale my yak. Which means I think that you should be here or here. Which is fine. We probably won't have hippos. Do I want to scale my koala? No, I feel like I would rather scale my... Chinchilla. Which means you should go here. But then you got to be here? Oh my god. That made it to subreddit drama. I was so confused. I was just blessed that I had like some form of gastroenteritis where I literally could not will myself to care. It's like it's a different YouTubers subreddit. Somebody posted like NL so based he follows ContraPoints because we played Among Us together in an event like three years ago. It kicks off a huge argument. Like, I mean, forgive me for saying like the classic, uh, you know, third grade playgrounds comeback, but like, just get a life. Come on, you gotta have more important shit going on than, than that. That's not worth your time. You got such a limited amount of time on planet Earth. Go, like, spend it with people you care about. That's just such like a, just such a strange place to be. Okay, garlic, garlic, you're scaling at 2-2 two, two per turn. You're 1-2 two per turn if we, no, you're actually 2-2, two, two, it's 2-2 two, two from this, and then another 2, no, another 1 from this, 3-2, 4-2, two, two, uh, two. okay, you're a 4-2, all right. I don't want to give you garlic yet, I think you're still pogging. Okay, okay. I don't think it's garlic time yet. I think everything's okay. I mean, the tamer, this is what happens every time with the tamarind. I don't know why I'm surprised. Um, everybody said, just give it a try once. I promise it'll pog. And then it came out and it was like fucking completely useless. We never got a second one. Um, now we could sell it. And we can give a completely meaningless buff to um, a koala. You're not doing anything with it? What do you want me to do with it? It's not doing anything. It doesn't do anything. You have to put stats into it? It has a croissant. Buff of 1-1 one, one with the dragonfly? Okay, 1-0 is not good enough. If you give it 1-1, one, one, then you'll really see it shine. Just one more lane, bro. Bro, please, I promise. Dude, look at the traffic. Just one more lane. Imagine how good one more lane would hit right now. Dude, imagine what one more lane would do for us. Holy cow. I mean, I'm not... I'm not selling him just yet. I'd rather just put you over there. Now I'm probably selling you, but I gotta think about where I really wanna put you. I guess I would can it up. I guess it would sell your ass. Seven five hatching chick. Could do worse, probably. Hey, it did something. Not really, though, considering, like, the investment in it. Oh, no, they have a vulture already. Whatever. Hit my hatching chick. No, no, no. no don't hit that. You're not supposed to hit that. Don't hit this. You're not supposed to... Get on! NL sickness is consuming his mental state. That's finally, someone's been listening to the cries for help that I put out over the last week. <laughs> yes, this is correct. 
Thank you for noticing. It feels good to be heard. Dude, you got to do something. You got to have like a, a you got to have a better use case, man. Maybe okay, hold on. 23124. So the koala wouldn't scale. That's okay. The dragonfly could scale. I mean, we have to sell probably like I guess we would sell we got to sell the dragonfly to make it fit. You would be a poodle. Okay. Sell it. Then our order can go back to something sane. Like this. The poodle can just fit. We have to make sure that the yak is to the left of the koala, unfortunately. So maybe not as sane as I thought it would be. But it's something at least. You know what? Take one of these for now. Okay. Seems okay. One HP. It hurts. Please. You can kill some chickens. You can draw with some chickens. Okay. You don't need this yet. That was optimistic. But there's no good foods in the pack. So I except for per perhaps a carrot. You know what? Take one of these. T probably should have taken it earlier. Vulture. I mean, it is kind of a pivot, but like we're, we're in a scaling team right now. You know what? Go ahead. Buy the lollipop. Every weekly, this is a controversial opinion, maybe. Every weekly should have chocolate in it. We've said it a few times, but like it's just it's just the honest to goodness truth. And pills. Pills are so important. Ants but no pill is like a it's a slap in the face, man. Okay. I feel like I could like the poodle buff is just random. You're right. You're right. I feel like we should try to get a gorilla out here and scale the crap out of it. We got enough HP to give it a chance. Yak's doing great on his own. And nobody else really needs it. Technically, you could give it uh, garlic and it might protect it from being hit once. The only... I think this is a smart play, but it looks stupid. So when I do it, everybody makes fun of me, which makes me not want to do it. So that instead, okay, I'll buy a 1-1 one, one buff for a koala. That's way more valuable than, than taking two damage off one time and possibly getting better coconut armor. Pepper, probably? Well, Pepper's not in the fucking shop right now. So what the hell am I supposed to do with that information? I don't have the ability to purchase Pepper. I live, bitch. It's not toxic. People suggest stuff like, well, instead of having... I, oh, I know I'm at Pizza Hut, but I could really go for, like, um, a shawarma right now. Okay, well, then you got to go to the damn shawarma hole. It's on the corner of Princess and Albert. You're the one who drove the damn car to Pizza Hut. You got you to gotta order something on the menu so we can make it to the appointment later today. Okay, this is fine. Roll me. I would love a pepper. If, if a pepper shows up, I, would, I, I love that. To, to be honest, I would buy another carrot as well, and I would certainly buy that next round. Princess doesn't intersect, Albert. I promise you it does in, in Kingston, Ontario. There's a, a great shawarma place there. I think it's called King Donaire. No. No. No, 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 no. Not, not like that. that. Honestly, your donkey just won you the game. Not anymore. It changed. Son of a bitch. Is nothing sacred? Honestly, you need the pop. <clears throat> I, oh, I'm just going to be honest. Now that I know it's out of business, that place was not that good. I ordered a falafel there once, and I watched the dude scoop it out of a... Like, uh... 
the, the tech deck in front of him and then just put it straight in the microwave. He made eye contact with me the whole time. She was mushy as hell. Okay. You can still do this. You do need a little support, like a gorilla. A gorilla? No gorilla. Okay. Um, I, will, I will take a poodle. I think this team can do it. We got a, nearly a maxed yak. We got a gorilla that's looking okay. We got a chinchilla in third. It's not that bad. Level two turtle, not ideal. 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 Okay, I told you, this is about the average squad I want to go up against. You can go now. But you're also like 1910, the stats are okay. I'm not just going to throw an orca on you out of spite, let me tell you. I'm not just going to throw a mammoth on you out of spite. I could be persuaded to throw a turtle on a fit, basically double the efficacy of a 5043. I think I could definitely be persuaded to do that. You know, you got to do what you got to do. Melon. No. <laughs> the melon doesn't protect from the scorpion. How did I not know that by now? Oh my god. Only the green pepper, man. But dude, honestly, I felt like we got a little bit more confidence at the end at least. 